Hey guys, welcome to another new video. My name is Prane and you are watching Pro Web Tips YouTube channel. Today in this video, I am going to show you how you can create a recipe card using WordPress block editor and you can see you can pretty much do everything using your block editor. You no need to install any third party plugin. So let's start. So uh, log into your WordPress dashboard then create a post or page whatever you want okay or you can uh, click on the plus sign then click on post and then you can give a title for, for testing purposes uh, we are going to create the same block as you can see on the screen which i have uh, created earlier so first you have to give the title then click on the plus sign then select group after selecting group then you have to select the image for demo purposes we have already uh, uploaded a image you can use whatever image you have in your WordPress website or you can uh, capture a photo and upload so upload the image then we have to give title or heading so we are going to select heading 2 then here give the name okay we are going to give cheese pizza then here description add recipe description now after the description uh, click on plus sign then search raw okay we are going to add for raw here first would be preparation time you select paragraph Okay. if you are using windows operating system then click on windows key and uh, semicolon key in your keyboard so it will open a emoji box and you have to search here time it will open the clock emoji you can select and then you have to type here preparation time and select all text and two in bold okay now we are going to align this text into the center so we have to uh, click on that and select text align center you have to do for all now the next step is to add the ingredient section so we are going to use a heading duplicate okay. here now change the from h2 to h3 and give the name here ingredient and you can use here the list whatever ingredients you have used to make the nail I am using that for our demo purposes if you are have a uh, recipe website then you can use the real ingredients name here I am just showing how you can create a recipe card okay and then again we are going to duplicate the heading and move down and then rename the ingredient to direction okay what kind of what direction will need to cook the particular meal again use list this is also demo text so you can modify afterward okay so almost done and now uh, we are going to add a social share uh, section for that you have to install a plugin uh, name social sharing block so as you can see here uh, in this section uh, use the social share block plugin for that you can go to the dashboard and then plugin and you have to install this plugin name social sharing block by nick diego you can search here by clicking add new then search new plugin okay and after installing that and activating the plugin you have to uh, click on the, on the plus sign then again group 
and change the uh, background of the group background select background and then select uh, whatever color you want okay you can use also gradient if you want and then add a title so click on the plus sign then select heading we are going to use h3 so like this recipe align center hit enter then click on plus sign then search social sharing okay it will uh, you, you can say social sharing this one you have to select this one and then you have to click on again plus sign and select your particular social media like I am going to use Facebook and again you have to set uh, some basic setting so click on social sharing here okay. and then you have to select build share and the layout justification would be center and share setting uh, you have to toggle show level so it will show the full name click on plus sign select pinterest again on plus sign then twitter and so on you can add other uh, social media uh, icon here so if you have done then you can publish the content uh, for now i am going to uh, save as draft and i am going to show you the preview as you see the earlier one uh, the earlier one has a a border line and this uh, doesn't uh, we are also going to add a border line for that you have to add a single line of CSS code on your particular uh, block or uh, you can use here the plus sign then search custom HTML okay and before that you have to click uh, this line select this group then click on advance and here you can add the additional CSS can uh, use whatever uh, class you want so I'm going to use a recipe card okay that's enough and then you have to add here some uh, styling CSS so add a style tag first close the style tag and between them you have to add First, uh, div and then recipe card. Whatever CSS classes you have used, you have to use uh, this CSS class in between this CSS styling tag. Okay, like a div dot recipe card then in between parenthesis okay you have to use border semicolon 2px solid gray okay now again save draft and see the preview it will show you the border line and you can also add the radius if you want so for now i'm going to leave as it is uh, this is your recipe card guys yes, and if you want to use in uh, other post and and if you don't want to create from scratch every time you can create a custom pattern using a plugin name you can see here the custom block pattern uh, you have to install the plugin I have a video about that how you can create a custom block pattern using that I will put the video in i button and also description so after installing the plugin you have to go to the block pattern section then uh, create a new pattern and what you need to do you have to copy the, all the code from here so how you gonna do uh, click on three dot here as you can see on the, my mouse uh, click on that and then copy all content 
and then return to the your uh, custom block pattern section and paste it here okay that's enough and you have to give your name of the custom block pattern yeah i'm going to do custom recipe okay custom recipe you can do name whatever you want then click on publish and suppose here i'm going to create a new post or page uh, whatever you uh, want to do you can do and if you uh, click on plus sign and search here custom recipe okay you can see here it will appear this pattern appear on here you can select and then modify according to your uh, recipe you can change the heading you can change the time from here you can change description ingredient etc okay so that's it guys if you like this video don't forget to subscribe our channel and thanks for watching have a nice day